it's Addie, and today we are watching episode two of The Last of Us. I imagine I'm going to say this about every single episode, but I'm nervous to see what comes next. Since I am completely new to this, I haven't watched the game, not watched the game, played the game, or I guess watch people play the game. You could do that too. But since I don't have any relationship with the game, all of this is completely new to me. So I'm learning everything literally just as the plot unfolds. So because of that, I have no earthly idea what could happen next. So I, I imagine I'm going to be on edge every single time, but it seems like this show is just so beautifully done so far. I mean, I'm only an episode in, this is about to be the second episode, but it seems so well done. And from what I've heard, it seems like it is accurate to the video game and is doing it justice. So I think that's so cool. I'm so excited to see what comes next. It seems like there's just a lot of love for the video game. So knowing how special the game is to everyone, I am very excited to continue with the show, see what comes next, to see what I don't know, just to see what adventures they get themselves into. I'm very curious to see more about Ellie. She seems like such a fun character, um, but just to find out her significance and why she's so important in this world. Um, I wasn't expecting that heartbreaking death in episode one. And I know that I read some comments where you all I mean, if you played the game, you know that you knew that that was going to happen and it was still heartbreaking. But I mean, tr <sighs> truly so heartbreaking. No one should ever have to go through that. Joel is protecting Ellie like a daughter in a sense. And so there are so many situations I'm sure that mirrors or those two situations mirror each other a lot. So I'm curious how that's going to play out. Um, uh, I can just tell, I mean, if, if just the first episode was heartbreaking, I can only imagine just how the rest of the, this season and future seasons are going to go. But let's do it! <laughs> I'm a little nervous, but ultimately I'm very intrigued to see what comes next. So let's dive in. This is episode two of The Last of Us. Tadi juga sudah mau selesai. Hmm. Wonder what she has to do with all of this mess. Apa bapak tidak salah orang? Ali Buratna, Profesor Mikologi. Hmm, I think we need your help. They are walking very quickly. Is this going to be like one of the first cases? Kami butuh bantuan Buratna untuk meneliti spesimen yang telah kami persiapkan. sebagai persiapan pengambilan sampel dari tubuh manusia, Bu Ratna. Kondisep tidak bisa bertahan pada manusia. Well, apparently you can. Jika Ibu merasa mual, sebaiknya Ibu segera keluar. This person isn't alive, right? Are they going to come alive? Okay, no. I think we're good. That's a bite. Apa ini gigitan manusia? I mean, I'm pretty certain this person is dead, but I'm still nervous. Yeah. Okay, well, that's still alive. Ugh, even though the person is dead. Okay, great. Di pabrik tepun dan gaba di barat kota. Hmm. Lahan yang sempurna untuk itu. Siapa yang menggigit perempuan itu, Pak? Kami tidak tahu, Ibu. Kami butuh vaksin. Butuh hmm. obat. Saya telah menghabiskan waktu hidup saya untuk mempelajari. Oh gosh, it's not gonna be possible. Tidak ada obat. Good. Jadi apa yang harus kami lakukan? Bom. Wow. Bom seluruh kota dan seluruh orang yang ada di dalamnya. Wow. Saya hanya ingin bersama dengan keluarga, hmm. bahkan suami dan anak-anak saya. Oh, she knows how bad this is. Morning. <laughs> Do I look like I'm infected? Show us your arm. Yeah, it's not getting any worse, is it? What was Marlene doing with an infected kid? 
I'm not infected. She found me after I was bitten. She locked me up and had her guys test me every day to see if I was getting sick. They'd make me count to ten and hold out my hand and then keep it steady. But you know, I think what really impressed them was the fact that I didn't turn into a f***ing monster. Yeah, that's true. Back there, you can find a spot. Is this her toilet paper? Places. There's not gonna be anything bad in here? Just you. Oh. <laughs> Maybe a hairline. It'll heal fast. All right, we're still close to the wall. We sneak her back into the QZ. We find a different way to get the battery. This is our best shot. You need to stop talking about this kid like she's got some kind of life in front of her. She might. Is that chicken? Probably until they get it from smugglers. Guess not you guys. Why are you so important to Marlene? Or well, we'll take you back. Don't get your battery. Then you must have heard that he wants to shoot you. Yeah. Joel and I aren't good people. But we don't know what you're worth if we don't know what we have. She told me not to tell anybody, and I'm telling the first people that I... They're working on a cure. Mm -hmm. I've heard this before. And whatever happened to me is it's the, the key, key to, to finding find in the vaccine. This isn't going to end well, Tess. We need to go back. It doesn't matter if she is or she isn't what the Fireflies say. If they believe that she is. If she so much as twitches. <laughs> don't. Maybe, yeah, maybe now is not the time to joke. <laughs> Can I have a gun? Absolutely no. No. not. Okay, Jesus, fine. I'll throw a fucking sandwich at them. <laughs> yeah, looks different in the daylight, huh? Uh... We should get moving. I would, would not be able to do this. More power to them. Is this where they bombed? Yeah. They hit most of the big cities like this. Oh, so they did end up bombing cities. It's the long way or the whiff dead way. Well, I vote long way is based on that limited information. <laughs> yeah, I, I also vote long way. Wow. Yeah, I, I want to know more about that story. You know the old mall in the QZ? Didn't think there was going to be anything in there, and then one just came at me out of nowhere. How old are you? 14. Mommy, I mean, you got some balls on you, sister. <laughs> I was not that brave at 14. Not that brave now. Nobody's gonna be coming after you, right? Like mom. I'm an orphan, and uh, no. So there aren't super infected that explode fungus spores on you? I hope not. <laughs> I imagine we're gonna find out. Oh, that's an infected. Oh no. Let's keep moving. At least they warn you that they're coming. They give a nice battle cry. No, no, this is very creepy vibes. Wait, are we going in there? I, I would not. Could the infected just well, be like I, swimming? I don't know how to swim. Seriously? This is so gross. Oh, check it out. No, don't, don't, don't stray away. Okay. Yes, sir, I would like your finest sweet, please. A weird kid. You're a weird kid. <laughs> <laughs> don't like that. Don't like that. I'm just gonna be on edge at all times, apparently. Yep. Fucking bad. <laughs> Come on, it wasn't that bad. You try climbing some floors with our knees. See how you feel. Yeah, I don't know what's scarier, what walking through buildings or just being out in the open. Well, I'm the smallest, so it'd be easier for me to get through. Mm -hmm. But you die and you get nothing. You stay. <laughs> Nice knife. Where'd you learn to do that? The circus. <laughs> to like uh pass. <laughs> How'd you end up in Boston? Not pass. gonna answer that one. No, or that one. About me. How long do infected live? Oh, I thought you went to school. It's a really sh one. <laughs> you ever kill one? Yeah, I killed lots of them. Is it hard? Like knowing they were people once? Sometimes. No gun down, Joe. Oh my gosh. What now? Oh no. She has seen something. Oh. Oh my gosh, and they're all alive. And you still wow. can imagine cordyceps in one place. And you can wake a dozen infected from somewhere else. I'm trying to keep you alive. Our lesson of the day. 
What do we do then? Museum. But who knows what we're gonna find in here? We're on the other side of this. Yeah, this does not look promising. Mm -mm. Cause it could awaken who knows it's bone what. Dry. Okay. Could mean they're all finally dead in there. Marlene Peck in one of these or just sandwiches? Yeah. I have a spare hand. Congratulations. <laughs> they're not giving you a gun. Oh my gosh. I imagine at some point, at least in this episode or in future episodes, she will need a gun. Ooh. I'm nervous they're going to step on something that's alive and then all of the infected are going to swarm to them. Oh sh! Oh, that's fresh blood. Oh no. That's very fresh. Could have been him. I don't hear it. Who would you hear? Okay, from this point forward. Okay, what did we that? are silent. Not okay. quiet. Silent. Okay. Hmm. I imagine these steps are going to be very creaky, though. Oh my gosh. All of those bodies. I hope none of them just wake up. <gasps> no! That could be a bad idea. That could be bad. That No, that is bad. Oh, they're coming. Something's coming. And maybe watch... Maybe watch where we step. Looks like the spores haven't spread, but that doesn't mean that nothing's in here. Oh, 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 something's coming. Ah. What is the clicking? No, 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 no. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> nope. Okay, so they can only hear us? Oh my gosh. Oh, he's right there. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. Well, okay. That looks, they look very different. Oh, Joel. We gotta get up. They look so different than the ones at the beginning. Yeah, it's like full mushroom heads now. Oh, it's coming. It's gonna be like right there. Yeah, it, we're too zoomed in on him. Ah. So I guess, can they not see? Can they throw something and distract us since they can only hear? I guess they would have to have something to throw in the first place. Where's Tess during all of this? Oh. Ah! No! Oh. Do not bite them. Do not bite them. Oh, it's so close to his face. Stronger. Uh. Okay, there's Tess. Thank you. Okay. Ah. Yeah, these are a lot harder to kill. You alright? I didn't sh my pants. <laughs> That's positive. Gold star for you. Again? I mean, if it was gonna happen to one of us. Let's get the f out of here. Yeah, agreed. On your arm. Thanks. Yeah, no, it looks scary. That was scary. This is wood. <laughs> it's still a little scary. I got it. I got it. Maybe the first bite didn't take. But what about the second? I thought you'd just take the good news. Do you think for once maybe we can actually win? Is it everything you hoped for? And Jury's more. still out. But man, you can't deny that for you. Come on, let's get there before it's dark. Oh, she's not gonna be able to run. It's kind of what happened to his daughter in the first place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have to watch out for her too. I mean, hopefully she's okay. In a normal world, this would be really pretty.
that he's gonna step on something. Oh, there's gonna be bodies. A lot of blood. Oh, this sound is not helping anything. going on? I don't know. Jess. Come on. Jess! We don't know what we're walking into. Uh, we're making a lot of noise. Oh, Jesus. I mean, there's got to be a radio or something, right? Who killed them? The healthy ones fought the sick ones. Everyone lost. Tess. Oh, so we don't even well, know. I mean, one we of them's got to gotta have a map on them. Joe, can you help me? No. We are going home. This is not my f***ing home! Our luck had to run out sooner or later. She's infected. What? Did she get a bite? Where? Show me. <gasps> Oops. I take your bandage off. This isn't spreading. This is real. Joshua's f***ing real. Never ask you for anything, not to feel the way I felt, yeah. not to you shut the f*** up because I don't have time. You keep her alive, and you set everything right. Please. Oh, no. <laughs> is that going to alert or wake up other ones? No. No. Are those all of the ones that were outside? Just like, writhing in the field? They're all coming. And they know exactly where to go. What are you doing? Making sure that they don't follow you. Say who you can save. I don't think we can save Tess. We're not leaving her! Get I think we have to do this. Oh, they're all coming. Oh, they're coming. Oh, they know you're here. We need an actual flame. No. No. No! Oh, that was terrifying. I don't even know what you could call call that. That's terrifying. Thank you, Tess. Huh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so I guess something big is probably going to happen in every episode, but since it's really just the two of us left, like we can't have more deaths right now. I mean, the first episode was shocking because of, I mean, just revealing this world and the heartbreaking death of his daughter. Now we're seeing Tess's death in this one, but uh, we're kind of running out of main characters to kill right now. so. I mean, nothing can happen to Joel. Like, if he's, if he's bitten, we're screwed. Like, it's just Ellie left. I mean, we have a little wiggle room for Ellie. Like, if she has a bite, it's looking like she's going to be okay. But, I mean, if she has multiple bites, I don't know what that's going to do to her. So, this is scary. This is terrifying. I could not do what they're doing. Honestly, I don't think I could play the video game because... I, I don't know, like, just watching this is scary. So actually, like, being a part of it and having to do all of the actions, no, I, I, don't, I don't think I could do it. That, that seems so scary. Wow. Um, so it sounds like Tess was talking about getting her to maybe Bill and Frank. Maybe the, that was their names. So I guess that's our next mission. But it sucks that the people that we were supposed to go to to meet with they're all dead or in the process of being turned. 
Um, we didn't exactly find a map of where to go besides just going west. So we have no idea where to go. <laughs> this is not looking good. So I guess the only thing they can do they can do is to go to I again, I think they said Bill and Frank. I I I, I don't know. The people that they know, I guess we have to go to them and hopefully we can get there safely. <laughs> this is so this is so wild and I'm glad that they're revealing more about the the virus is it a virus the they're they're just revealing more about the process of how it started and kind of what led to now i mean they were bombing whole towns to try to keep it contained um it started in a flower factory essentially is what it sounds like and it's crazy to think that Going back to the first episode, there were so many moments that Sarah and Joel could have had flour. I mean, they were talking about the birthday cake. They were talking about making pancakes, but neither of those happened. And then the neighbors, they were eating biscuits at the beginning and then they made cookies. Like there are so many moments that they could have been infected. But here we are. I mean, 20 years later, Joel isn't infected yet. So, oh, this is wild. I mean, this is only two episodes in and so many huge things have happened. So I'm just very curious uh, to find out what happens next. I'm going to be on edge in every single episode because I don't know what to expect, but it's so well done. I mean, I mean the story, I'm so intrigued uh, and I can't wait to find out what comes next, but very nervous for sure. Well, that was episode two of The Last of Us. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe and we will see you next time.